What do most countries have in common? According to the World Health Organization, unsafe air. The WHO recently conducted a study. It analyzed air pollution across 134 nations and regions, and it came to a disturbing and shameful conclusion. Only seven countries on Earth breathe clean air. Australia, Estonia, Finland, Grenada, Iceland, Mauritius, and New Zealand. Only seven. All other nations breathe toxic air, some more than others, like Asian and African nations, with Bangladesh, Pakistan and India leading the pack. So what's behind this? And what does this mean for our world? Our next report tells you. Human beings have certain basic needs. They need four major things to survive. Food, water, shelter and air. If even one of these things is threatened, it becomes difficult to lead a healthy life. And that's exactly what is happening. Our fourth need, the air we breathe, is under threat. Air pollution is the world's leading environmental cause of death. It kills about 7 million people every year the world over. This is more than the deaths from AIDS and malaria combined. Because across the world, most countries breathe unsafe air. There are only seven outliers, Australia, Estonia, Finland, Grenada, Iceland, Mauritius and New Zealand. These are the few oases of safe air. As disturbing as this is, we aren't making this up. The World Health Organization says so. It studied air pollution levels across 134 nations and regions and found that all but seven nations have toxic air. But they don't suffer equally. The worst air quality is mostly in Asia and Africa, ironically, where the vast majority of human population lives. And who leads the pack? These are the five most polluted countries in the world. Bangladesh, Pakistan, India, Tajikistan and Burkina Faso. In Bangladesh, the pollution is 15 times higher than the WHO guideline. In Pakistan, it is more than 14 times higher. And in India, more than 10 times higher. But remember, this is an average. The deeper you dig, the worse it gets. So the World Health Organization did not just study nations, it also focused on cities. 7,800 cities were analyzed globally. A list of 100 cities with the worst air pollution was prepared. Of all these names, 99 cities with the worst air pollution on Earth are in one continent, Asia. And 83 of them are in one country, India. Which is the most polluted city in the world? Begu Sarai in the state of Bihar. It is home to half a million people. And air pollution that is 23 times the WHO guideline. Followed by Gohati in Assam and the capital city of New Delhi. Now, India is not the only country in a smoggy spot. So is its neighbour, China. In 2014, Beijing announced a war against pollution. It made substantial progress. But after years of improvement, China saw a 6.3% increase in pollution levels in 2023. Why? Because China saw an uptick in economic reopening last year post-Covid. At least that's the reason China cited. What about other countries? What's behind their soaring air pollution levels? In Asia and Africa, vehicle traffic, crop and wood burning are some of the big reasons. In North America, it's wildfires. But there's one major reason which can be blamed the world over. Fossil fuel emissions. This is the biggest contributor to air pollution. It causes one in five deaths worldwide. Yet, despite all the research and roundtables, a solution to air pollution has not found its seat at the table. So, billions of people have no choice but to breathe toxic air daily.